Despite today's snowfall, fire season will be coming this summer. In fact, yesterday the Bureau of Land Management actually reported a small wildfire near Ledor. Local News 8's Evan Thomason shows us the fire danger we can expect going into spring based on our snowpack. Fire season is quickly coming back to eastern Idaho. The Bureau of Land Management is planning on measuring the water content of soils around the region next month to determine the specific fire risk going into summer. Chris Berger with BLM already has a general idea of what to expect heading into the next few months. The historic winter snowpack could protect the mountains from fire danger until this winter. There's a very good chance that the higher elevations will still contain a lot of moisture. In fact, some places may not even lose snow through the summer. It will be there late into the summer, and I would anticipate that we would see um, decreased fire danger in the higher elevations. Yet the valley should expect an increase in fire potential. Over the next few months, we are going to have a small period of elevated fire danger as we come out of winter and into spring because the dead fuels and dormant fuels from last year will be uncovered and they'll dry out rather quickly, in some cases an a couple hours, and they'll become available to burn. These predictions stand firm only up until July. What happens next will determine the peak fire weather conditions. Depending on if we stay in this cool wet pattern that we're currently in or if we turn off into the typical high pressure, hot, clear skies and dry, um, that, that's going to be the wild card that will either push us into uh, a fire season proper or we'll stay at a, at a, at a decreased fire, wildfire danger in the area. Reporting in Idaho Falls, I'm Evan Thomason. Peak fire season is from July through September.